As the world's largest branded beef program, Certified Angus Beef prides itself on quality at every level. That includes an extensive network of ranchers, chefs, retailers, and other partners who ensure the brand's success. During its recent annual conference in West Virginia, brand partners met to learn cutting-edge marketing and sales information and to celebrate another outstanding year. Nearly 600 certified Angus beef brand leaders recently gathered at the Greenbrier in White Sulphur Springs, West Virginia for the 2012 Certified Angus Beef Annual Conference. The event offered opportunities for partners to more effectively leverage the brand and insight on industry trends shaping their businesses. This is where the meat buyers and sellers all come together. This is where the market happens. This isn't one group fighting over another group about some issue. This is trying to figure out how do we make more of it and make more money together. And I like that. So this conference has been a real eye-opener for me and one I've thoroughly enjoyed. The greatest thing is that you see the end users who absolutely love the product that you are producing at home. And you see the passion behind our brand supporters and they want more of it. So if I had a message to communicate to a producer, it's, it's stay involved or get involved and get, get in a place where you can really stay connected in terms of the information and communication. Because if you're producing the cattle of a better kind and a better quality, you need to take advantage of that. And instead of putting those up for uh, a marketing opportunity that would just be out to the masses, focus that marketing effort so that those cattle can actually meet the, and they do, they have the opportunity to meet the needs of these end users that are here and then you're part of a system and as a result you can get more value for being a part of a system versus not. So if you're interested in producing value added or value cattle, now it's not uh, choice cattle, it's upper two-thirds certified Angus beef quality cattle or prime quality cattle. And to me, that's our entire target is we're going to produce those extra valued cattle. If we don't have those premiums to go pursue, we're all relegated to a commodity type business. And in a commodity type business, then it becomes who can do it the cheapest, you know. So, so we're, we're interested in finding those cattle that can generate premiums and, and generate value uh, from the rancher clear through retail. The conference delivered more good news for the brand. Certified Angus Beef set its sixth consecutive sales record in fiscal year 2012, with more than 810 million pounds of CAB products sold during the last 12 months. That record-setting growth has happened in spite of the sluggish economy and points to continued consumer demand for high-quality eating experiences. I, I think it's first testament to our partners that drive the brand, both retail, food service, international. They've been very focused on the idea that the quality is really what the consumer wants in any of those areas. And the fact that they've been able to attain those kinds of numbers this year, in spite of all-time record uh, high prices, tighter supplies, and we're, we're confident in the future that um, they're not driven, the consumer, ultimately by what is the price. Uh, it's not being purchased because they see it as a value option based upon price. They see it as a value option in terms of customer satisfaction. For more information, visit CertifiedAngusBeef.com or read conference highlights at GoRare.com. For the Angus Report, I'm Cindy Campbell.